Javelin is the car that bridges the generation gap. Young performance-minded buyers are excited by it, and their fathers go for it in a way that indicates at least some are bent on making up for the fun they missed. Mr. Carlson and his son, Don, are a good example. A Javelin TV commercial first caught Don's eye. Then Don noticed an ad in the local paper and pointed it out to his father. The next thing Mr. Carlson knew, he turned up with Don to get a first-hand look at the Javelin. Let's listen to Al's approach. He's trying to determine what car to show them. After listening a bit, you'll have a chance to tell why you decide to show a Javelin. Listen for the information Al digs out. I'll ask a question and sound a tone like this. That will be your cue to stop the record and answer the questions. Then you can start the record again and compare your answer with Al's. Hello, I'm Al Bender. Joe Carlson, and this is my son, Don. I'm glad to meet you, Mr. Carlson. Don, is that your Mustang out there? Yes, it is. Are you pretty well satisfied with it? Yes. No. Well, when we first got it, I didn't really like it. But I soon learned to like its pep and sporty looks. But, Dad, the Javelin is really with it. It's got the now look. It did look pretty snappy in the ad Don showed me, so I agreed to come and look at it. Well, Don's right about Javelin's looks. And you'll find that it has even more pep than your present car, Mr. Carlson. How big is your family? There are four of us, so we want a car big enough for the family. Well, you'll like the Javelin, then. It's a good all-around car for a family like yours. Before going on, let's take a minute to review the reasons Al has for showing the Javelin. What are the points you picked up from this conversation? There were three points Al noticed and will keep in mind as he makes his presentation. The points are, Mr. Carlson is driving a competitive car, he said he wanted to look at the Javelin, and he has a family of four. So, Al took him right to the Javelin. Al usually starts off with a general statement about the Javelin. He mentions its racing success, its new, more powerful engines, its sporty appearance, and range of options. Before listening to Al, let's see how you would start your presentation as you see the car. This is the car that surprised the racing world in 1969, the Javelin SST. With the new 360 and 390 Go package engines, it will even go better in 1970. It has a new, long, racy profile to back up its big Go package performance. And our list of standard and optional features lets you have both a sporty, elegant look and a top performer. This is our SST 390 model, Mr. Carlson. Very sporty looking, with its mag-styled wheels, rally stripe, and this Landau-style vinyl top. Don't you think? Well, it's a lot more racy than I expected. Is this the one you saw on TV? It was a little different, but it was a Javelin. The one in the paper had a spoiler on it, and this one doesn't. I wish you'd get one of those. I don't even know what that is, but we'll worry about that after I see how this car drives. Well, I'll be very happy to give you a demonstration, Mr. Carlson. But there are some features I'd like you to see first. As Joe opens the door and gets seated, Al demonstrates the adjusto-tilt column. Then he calls attention to the bucket seats with a built-in headrest and the rim blow horn. Now he takes Joe and Don outside to his demonstration model. I'll drive out to a good spot for you both to try the wheel. Don, why don't you hop in the back and let your father sit up front? You got enough room back there? More than there is in the car we have now. As Al puts the key in the ignition, he talks about the anti-theft lock. Then as he starts the car, he talks about the shift command. This model has the shift command mounted on the console. But you do have other options. Like four on the floor? What would you tell Don and his father in answering this question? This is the way Al answered. You bet. Our four-speed manual transmission is optional on the Javelin. It comes with the Hurst shifter mounted on the floor. It's a close ratio, all synchro mesh gearbox. This one suits me fine. After Joe has taken a turn, Al lets Don try it out because it's clear that Don is going to have some influence on his father's decision. Al decides to show them the engine as soon as they get back from the demonstration drive. How would you describe the engine options to Joe and his son?
The Javelin has a wide range of engines. They run from a 232 cubic inch six cylinder engine with 145 horsepower up to this 390, four barrel V8 with 325 horsepower. Boy, with that 390, I could make Harry look like he's standing still with his souped up Mustang. Don't forget your mother will drive too. Well, the 360, especially with the Go package, has plenty of power for Don, and with variable ratio power steering, it will be very easy for Mrs. Carlson to handle. What on earth is a Go package? This is the kind of question your pocket facts will help you answer. How would you answer Joe's question about the Go package? Well, there's a lot in it. Let me double check it. Now, here it is. A 364 barrel V8, dual exhaust system, power front disc brakes, E70 by 14 red line wide profile tires with six inch rim, handling package, ram air induction system with AMX hood. That is a lot. Probably costs a lot too. Well, remember, it's what you get for your money that counts. Now, if you'll come into the office, I'll check the prices and we can decide just how you want to personalize your javelin. We might start with the color. Now, the big bad colors, orange, blue, and green, have been very popular around here. Or perhaps one of the new metallic tones. I go for the orange we saw. That's too much for me and your mother. How about that red, Don? Well, it doesn't say as much to me as those big bad colors, but it's okay. Well, how about this corduroy to go with that red? Another very popular choice is the real leather. Either red or black would go well with that outside red you chose. Well, I know the leather would look snappy, but your mother would greatly prefer corduroy, and so do I. You can pick the color if you want, Don. The youngsters are not making all the decisions today, but they are making quite a few. Fortunately, the Javelin has many features that are easy for the youngsters and their parents to agree on. Uh -huh. 